What's up YouTube? I'm back once again with another DIY Tesla Power update video. As you guys can see, I'm doing something quite interesting today. I am basically going to be making a cheesy just to show a bit of a load test. This is a 800 watt cheesy maker and it's pretty much heated up right now. So I'm going to butter all this up and see if we can manage to cook one. And then we'll also look at the voltage drop and then the solar panel input and stuff. So um, yeah, this just kicked in. Uh, the voltage just dropped down to 23.4. I'm running on some lead acid batteries. Don't mind the cables. Fan just kicked in. And yeah, so I'm just going to let that keep heating up and I'm going to get all this set up so we can run this load test. Just to show you what's working, I'm just going to put that on. You can hear it sizzling. So we've got the cheesy maker down now. Uh, the battery voltage has dropped to 23.87, 22 on the inverter. So uh, we're pulling in 222 watts with three amps of solar cu current coming in. So that's basically just propping this up to a stable voltage that the inverter can run on. Um, but other than that, it's working. Uh, without the solar panels, this probably wouldn't be able to run because uh, these lead acid batteries that I'm using aren't very strong. So um, that is pretty much it for this video. I'll show you the final product to prove it's obviously cooked it. Um, there's no like trickery or anything. So now we'll just uh, give it a bit of a test just to see. Looks like it's actually cooked. So I'd say that's a uh, successful test. So if you did enjoy this little like low test video, please give this video a like and subscribe for more DIY Tesla Power update videos. And I'll see you guys in the next video.